Hi friend, in this tutorial we will learn how to create this type of CSS loading animation. Like this you can see on my screen here. So let's get started this video. So here you can see I have opened my HTML style file, HTML file here index.html file and here you can see I have this file folder and you can see here I am typing this title is gradient CSS loading animation and now go to this body section and I am typing a class name that is loader and now I will style open file, my style file on the body section here so I will type this basic style file that is margin padding and box sizing so after adding this so now we will copy this body section here and now we will open this body section now we will add this display flex and justify content center align item center and we will add for this item here align item we will add this now for the main white so it will be vertically center or align element here and I will add this background that is black color like this you can see a plain black color here and now we will copy this class name loader so it and put this class name here so loading class name and now we will type this position relative and here we will add this width and height for this equal for width and height is I will add this equal size is for this 150 pixel and now we will add for this here we will add this border radius that will be 50% so it will be a circle and here I will testing adding a testing background so I'm just showing you that it's working or not so you can see the white background color and now we will change this color value here we will add a linear gradient color so let's add this linear gradient color here this it will be 45 degree transparent and so I have mistake there so let's type this again the transparent and transparent 40% and this color code hashtag ff0560 so this is our color code and you can see here this type of circle here so now let's copy this class name again this loader class name and type here and we will add a before class here before adding before we have to add a margin section on the loading class so this loader class and we have added this margin 0 and 30 pixel and now we will add this loading before and this section will add a content box and now we'll add this position is absolute so now we'll add this top left bottom and right so we'll add this total this exactly i want to make this space from the top bottom left and right so that will be 10 pixel and here i'm typing this background the same color that is black so you can see like this so now we'll add a border radius here so let's add this the border radius will be 50 percent so it will be a circle so you can see there so now let's copy this full item here we can copy this and paste this full item like this and just send the values before and here we will add this after and now we'll just remove this all of this size top bottom left and right so all will be zero here because we want to make this one side up and one side down so it will be exact same places so you can see here like this so now we have to add a z index here so this color code first we will make it here this copy here and now we'll add a z index so you can see that background is after option is showing here so we'll make this after option is the blow layer before after this after will be show with this before selection here so that's why we added this before z index 2 and this after is z index 1 and here we'll add this filter blow so that will be a good effect on this outside so you can see like this and now we'll add a animation property here on this loading say class here we'll add this animation loader and it will be 0 0.5 seconds so I will type this 0.5 second and linear infinite so after adding this copy this loader and we will open here the keyframe I have typed some another keys ok let's add this keyframe here and I will add this value for this animation and it will be 0% and it will, will be transform is rotated 0 degree and when its value is 100% so I am just copy paste here 100% and it will be 360 degree so now we will see here it's loading and it's working for a circle so now let's add some more effect here so like this and we will add a more effect into this here so just copy this this element property here animation property and we will add this before and after section so that will be the before and after section also will be moving like a circle so let's select it and this loader and here we will add a hover effect for this loader section let's copy this loading and hover and we will be type this background color code and here we will add a for this a box size box shadow here that will be a good effect on a hover on the circle 
So let's add this box shadow and here we'll type this border radius 50%. So it will be circular and you can see when we hover on it, it will be good full of this light color and it will be a box shadow is showing here this good effect here. So now let's go to here this section here this animation property and we'll hide this here. Now you can see like this. Okay. Now let's go to this animation property and we'll add a filter for it will be colorful. So we'll make it a 360 color effect here. So we'll just filter you rotate and 0 degree and 360 degree. So you can see that a lot of color is showing here. This the hue rotate color is almost showing here. So you can see like this. So this hour is almost everything is completed here. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thanks for watching this video and make sure to subscribe our channel and please click on to this like button and give your feedback into our channel if you want any other like tutorial. Thank you for watching.